since I was very very young, you know, I knew that something is not right. You know, as young as I was in like primary school, I remember telling my friend that um, I'm actually a girl. So I started to transition right after I did my national service. That was like 12 years ago. Yeah, so basically from there I was like, um, yeah, I know I want to be a woman. My parents, uh, they don't really actually, I mean, they don't accept, accept it. So I have to be, I have to like um, take hormones secretly and, you know, I have to, you know, get ready outside of my house, you know, in order to, you know, to, to wear a woman clothes. So I have to like actually carry a very big bag. But actually they knew, they knew about me. They knew about who their son is actually, you know, since he's very, very young. But as parents, they basically they want me to actually live normal life as a normal guy. But, well, that's not me. The first point of uh, transitioning, maybe I don't look good. I still look kind of manly or you know, not family enough. So basically, people look and sneer, you know, but they don't really, they don't really jealous or whatsoever. Like, no, no kind of vulgarities or bad words coming from her. They just look, give me, give me one kind of look and, you know, but I just shake it off, no matter. Definitely. When I send my resume, they look at my resume, you know, and they, they're interested. So when they call me for interview, they interviewed me very well, but when they got to know somehow or other that I'm not who I'm, who I was supposed to be, you know, they go, okay, ma'am, I will we'll give you a call, that kind of stuff, and then I don't get any response back. Drastic uh, surgery, no. I still hold, you know, I see, um, but I do my goals, you know. I do, uh, I'm on hormone therapy for very great surgery, like being, being a post-op, I don't think so, because I wanted to do it last year, but because my parents objected, objected to it, so I have to respect that. Most of my friends, uh, they do it um, in Bangkok. Cost factor basically is uh, less than 10k, less than Singapore 10k. But if you do it in Singapore, definitely it would cost more. Lah. If I were to get a green light for my parents, me, definitely I would do it. Lah. We are, we, are, we are also human, and you know, we are normal people, we are harmless, you know, this is what we are. Yes, it is a choice, but like for myself, this is what I chose, you know. I want to, I want to be a, I want to be like this. And, I mean, I went through NS, two years NS, without declaring that, you know, I'm not straight or whatever. I, I was a best A personnel, so basically, I went through everything. So, I knew that I'm strong inside, but that doesn't mean that I can be a real, you know, normal man. We are just normal people, we are harmless, so I mean, give us opportunities, that kind of stuff.